let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Angel of God, my guardian dear, to whom God's love commits me here, ever this day be at my side, to light and guard, to rule and guide. Amen. Good morning, God. You are ushering in another day, untouched and freshly new. So here I am to ask you, God, if you'll renew me too. Forgive the many errors that I made yesterday and let me try again, dear God, to walk closer in your way. But Lord, I am well aware, I can't make it on my own. So take my hand and hold it tight, for I cannot walk alone. Lord, I am weary and don't know when this race will end in my life. I feel like I've been running forever, trying to outrun this trial. Help me to stop trying to outrun my pain but rather run with endurance the race you have set before me. I know that because of you I am ultimately a victor over the trials in my life. I know that nothing in this world can separate me from your steadfast love. Please give me a measure of your love today. Give me the strength to endure this trial. Thank you for your love for me that never ends. And thank you for the crown of joy that awaits me forever in your kingdom. Amen. Lord, grant me tenacious winsome courage as I go through this day. When I am tempted to give up, help me to keep going. Grant me a cheerful spirit when things don't go my way. And give me the courage to do whatever needs to be done. In Jesus' name. The Act of Adoration O great God, the Sovereign Lord of heaven and earth, I prostrate myself before you. With all the angels and saints, I adore thee. I acknowledge you to be my Creator and Sovereign Lord, my first beginning and last end. I render to you the homage of my being and life. I submit myself to your holy will, and I devote myself to your divine service this day and forever. I wish and purpose to gain today all the indulgences which it is possible for me to gain. Amen. O oh my God, I firmly believe all the sacred truths which your holy Catholic Church believes and teaches, because you have revealed them who either can deceive nor be deceived. Amen. O oh my God, relying on your infinite goodness and promises, I hope to obtain the pardon of my sins, the assistance of your grace, and life everlasting through the merits of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen. O oh my God, I love you above all things with my whole heart and soul purely because you are infinitely perfect and deserving of all love. I love also my neighbor as myself for the love of you. I forgive all who have injured me and ask pardon of all whom I have injured. Amen. The Act of Thanksgiving O Glorious Trinity, I praise you and give you thanks for the numberless benefits you have bestowed upon me. I thank you, O Heavenly Father, for having created me to your own image and likeness, and for having preserved me to this day. I thank you, O merciful Son, for having redeemed me by your death, and so often fed me with your precious body and blood. I thank you, O Holy Spirit, for having cleansed my soul by your grace and holy baptism, for having called me to the true faith, and so often washed me from my sins in the sacrament of penance. I thank you, O most bountiful God, for preserving me this night and granting me this day to serve you. 
I earnestly invite all the saints of heaven and earth to join with me in praise and thanksgiving for your infinite goodness. Adorable Jesus, divine model of that perfection to which we should all aspire, I will endeavor this day to follow your example, to be mild, humble, chaste, zealous, patient, charitable, and resigned. Incline my heart to keep your commandments. I am resolved to watch over myself with the greatest diligence, and to live soberly, justly, and piously for the time to come. I will take care of my ways, that I may not offend with my tongue. I will turn away my eyes, that they may not see vanity. And I will be particularly attentive not to relapse this day into my habitual failings, but to struggle against them with your gracious assistance. Enlighten my mind, purify my heart and guide my steps, that I may pass all my life in your divine service. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of thy faithful and kindle in them the fire of thy love. Send forth thy Spirit, and they shall be created, and thou shalt renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, who did instruct the hearts of thy faithful by the light of the Holy Spirit, grant us in the same Spirit to be truly wise, and ever to rejoice in his consolation. Through Christ our Lord, Amen. Eternal Father, I offer thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the Masses said throughout the world today, for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. O Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your sacred heart, in union with the holy sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world, in reparation for my sins, for the intentions of all our associates, and in particular for the intentions of our Holy Father for this month. The Holy Father's Intentions This Month For a Eucharistic Life we pray that Catholics may place the celebration of the Eucharist at the heart of their lives, transforming human relationships in a very deep way and opening to the encounter with God and all their brothers and sisters. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for watching our video. Subscribe and like for more videos like these. God bless.